Open File Explorer, go to Documents, open Adobe, open Premium Pro, open your Premium Pro's latest version. Here you should see a folder called Profile hyphen, your username, select it, and then copy it. Go to a USB drive and paste your profile folder there. Now eject your USB drive from your computer. Insert the USB drive to your MacBook. Open Finder, go to Documents, open Adobe, open Premium Pro, go to the latest version, right click and copy your profile folder and paste it here to create a backup. Open the profile folder and then open your USB drive, open the profile folder of your Windows, press Command A to select all the files and then copy all the files. Go to your Mac profile folder and then paste. Then you will get a message, an item named Premium Pro prefs already exists in this location. Do you want to replace it with the one you are copying? Select apply to all and then select replace. You can select the win folder and delete this because this is the folder for your keyboard shortcuts and the format is different so it can't be transferred to your Mac. You should watch my other video on how to transfer Premium Pro shortcuts from Windows to Mac. If you would now open the settings folder, you should find the custom folder, open it and this is your sequence presets. And unfortunately, Premium Pro won't recognize sequence presets that are created in Windows on a Mac machine. Go to the profile folder that you have copied before as a backup and then open settings folder. And here, if you have customs folder, open it. These are sequence presets that you have created on Premium Pro Mac version. If you don't have a custom folder, then you don't need to do anything. Otherwise, copy the presets and paste in your custom folder so that Premium Pro could access them. Now, open Premium Pro, then you might get this message saying Premium Pro requires access to the following folder, Downloads. So click on Open Preferences and then make sure Downloads folder access is turned on. Enter your username's password to allow and then select Quit and reopen then click on quit now open premium pro again this time it should load you can create a new project and then test to check whether your layout and settings are transferred successfully from your windows to your mac now if you would select file hover your cursor over new and then select sequence you might not see the custom folder then you could create a sequence preset for example from your timeline and now again if you go to sequence you should be able to see the custom folder and now if you go to your custom folder on mac you should be able to see the saved preset but as i said before premium pro on mac won't recognize sequence presets that were created on windows